Ooh, I'm looking something here. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Welcome to Coffee Talk. Day after Thanksgiving, Black Friday. Um, I am at the gym because it is 38 degrees outside and freezing. And my niece is here, as you guys know, and she has to do these crazy Navy works at workouts. Um, and, uh, so she's doing like pull-ups and all kinds of shit. Um, and we got up this morning and I put on Christmas music in the house and I started changing out all my decorations from fall Thanksgiving to Christmas. And she's like, why are you... It's like 8.30 in the morning. I'm like, yes, but it brings me so much joy. Why would I wait? So, um, hold on. I already got to block people. It's fucking early as shit. So anyway, um, I started taking down all of my Thanksgiving fall decorations and putting up my Christmas decorations. And I have found decorations that my kids absolutely love that are so cheap and easy to put together. And I'm gonna show you some later because I think a lot of times people think if they wanna decorate their house, they have to spend a lot of money, but I do not. I find really fun ways to use things that I already have in the house as decor. So I'm gonna show you later a couple of things that I do that are cheap that we absolutely love. So you can try some of them if you want to. Anyway, so I am walking on the treadmill, which I don't love. I prefer to walk outside, but what happened? I have to run in between the 100 meters. Oh my God. I need to do it outside, that's easier. Um, go outside. No. And freeze to death. Oh, you could probably do the push-ups right there. Yeah. Well, I will not be doing push-ups or pull-ups. I hate this. I miss my gym. Just do distance, maybe. Is there a track? Well, look at the side buttons, Mal. What's the sorry? I would do distance. I know, but is there a picture? Like, usually they have, like, a track or something. Um... I don't know, girl. I never use a treadmill, so I don't know. Um, anyway, so um, I wanted to check in with you guys and see how everybody did for the holiday. Did you set boundaries? Did you keep your composure? Did Were people respectful? Did you enjoy yourself? Did you let yourself eat the things that you wanted to eat? We ate two dinners yesterday. Well, one was a lunch, and then we ate leftovers for dinner and it was delicious um cleat said yes there's a track i don't know where it is but okay well we don't know how to work it cleat um so just checking on you guys overall i know some people are in mourning some people are still grieving uh some people are dealing with difficult families some people didn't see family at all and so I'm just checking on you to see overall how you're doing. Um, Yesterday was a great... um, Yesterday was a great... Oh, she can do real push-ups. Oh, you could do real push-ups. Okay. Um, Military training is no joke, y'all. No joke. This is why I can't join the military. Because I'll be like, excuse me, sir. Can I walk? They'll be like, no. I'll be like, well, this ain't going to work for me. Um, 
Now she's doing pull-ups, by the way. Like real fucking like like Demi Moore pull-ups and shit. Um, so for any of you that are grieving or in mourning or were left out or not invited or ridiculed or belittled or shamed on Thanksgiving, I just want to tell you they can kiss your ass. And that's really how I feel. I just think that people who use a holiday knowing the emotional impact that holidays have and the emotional significance that holidays have for people to purposefully leave them out. I just, ugh, I can't stand people like that. Um, and if you're mourning or grieving, I just want you to know that I love you and I've been there and it took me 25 years, 24 years, but it does get better. And I just want you to know that it does get better. It might take two decades, but it does get better. Um, and also guys exercise I know I beat it into you and I bring it up every day but it's so important to move your body it literally it's so good for you and it centers you and I just if you're thinking about it or you watch me walk every day and you think that's not for me it is for you you don't have to go fast I don't go fast. I don't run. First of all, I would pee my pants. Let's be honest, okay? My bladder is shot. I would pee all over myself if I tried. I used to run, but I don't anymore. And you can do it. You can get up and walk with me. We could do it together. You can walk slow. You can start to move your body. You will feel so good. You will sleep better. Um, I slept eight hours and five minutes have really good sleep last night um, and um, and to everybody who bought one of the state of style double-sided tea towels today I turned over all my Thanksgiving towels to my Christmas towels and it was so fun and easy and super cute it's not too late to get your holiday tea towel if you want you can go to stateofstylejewelry.com and look at all the tea towels we have in stock you order today Mary will ship them out Monday morning you will love them um, thank you Jessica Plumeri for being here with us thank you Audrey Lawrence for being here with us thank you Daniel Vasquez for sharing I love you guys so much I'm so grateful for you um, do I do light weights in the gym no love I don't do any weights I'll just walk. Works for me. I don't really care that much about like strength. Um, not much. I should. My lower back is trash. Hello, Marissa Case. Rhonda Blakely. Good morning, everybody. Um, good morning, Stephanie Lockwood. I am going to take my niece.